You'd think that during the middle of a massive surge of people, those detention beds would be at capacity. Why aren't they? They aren't detaining because Mayorkas knows that detention is deterrence. And so they're just processing people in, paroling them right away and sending them into our country. And the phone calls go back to the countries of origin, telling their friends and families, come on, the door is open. The interim final rule is a rule that Secretary Mayorkas is trying to change and actually remove the judiciary branch from the decision-making on asylum. Even though Congress passed the laws many, many years ago that said the judiciary is to be involved. Why would Secretary Mayorkas want to do away with the judiciary? Why would he want to subvert laws written by this body, the, con the Congress? It's because they want more people to come into the country. And now their solution is an app where whomever fills it out just automatically gets parole when they show up at the crossing site. That is in total contravention to what the laws passed by Congress about how people are to enter this country. I can see it now. Some drug cartel coyote. Hey, for an additional fee, we'll fill the app out for you. Secretary Mayorkas's budget, a detailed analysis of it shows they're not doing anything to increase Border Patrol in any significant amount or increase technology. All it does is increase the funds, and I'm talking about billions of dollars, to process and ship people all over the United States. That's where they're asking for more money.